What's up, guys? Me here. And today I'm bringing you episode two of Pack Power, where I am showing you the team that I came up with with the players I got from the silver packs, which I have to admit are pretty shit player players to be honest. See what I've. This guy is pretty good. This Gary, someone I don't know. He's French. Plays in League Two in the French league, and. This guy, best guy ever. I found out he's worth like 8k, 10k, something like that, in between there. So he's pretty decent. As he's the best player I've got in a pack, so yeah, pretty decent. <laughs> and I was playing 4 5 1, which I thought would be a good idea at the time to get the most chemistry. But it's like 51 chemistry I've got now, which isn't the best, but still. What's well, just over half you can get pretty much. And, uh,. Yeah, so we're going to the silver tournament. As you can see here, obviously I didn't decided didn't want to edit this bit, obviously. <laughs> okay then. Nice. How long's that going for? Fuck it out. Oh, not a lot of people will actually play in the silver tournament. You might want to skip ahead here. There you go. <laughs> so we go up against Seth's army. Seth's army who has a amazing team because look at that a bond the whole king up front with bloody Campbell and Phillips on the right Ferdinand um, that Jamaican centre back I know he's got like 77 pace and it's crazy good but as you see here, down the wing with my player. <laughs> I don't know. See, I don't even know any of these players' names. That's the problem. And I call this guy Striker. I think that's Burgett. Burgett? <laughs> Just Scholes. <laughs> Cross it in. And look at that. He makes a perfect run off the ball there. Didn't stand a chance. Didn't stand a chance. And you can see here, he got broke. He got... Fucking... He played a free ball to a bond hole. He uses his pace. And just messes up. Pretty shocking, to be honest. Right, form. So I'm winning, I'm, winning one, I'm winning one nil. But look at that header from my striker to the centre defensive mid there. So it was good. See, look at that just run. That's a beautiful, what two passes and through to goal. And as this was my first game with this team, they they play really like I don't know. They play well together, really, but since they only have 51 chemistry but the problem is with this team there's no pace in it at all when you come up against these Premier League teams it's just ridiculous like to deal with that but my keeper is pretty decent I'm glad I got a good keeper but I just need some a good midfielder like uh, maybe left mid right mid something like that just a midfielder or another striker could do another striker but just need to get Another decent player. But here, that my striker just uses pace, burns the defender. And fucking so should have scored. <laughs> I thought I scored, but I didn't score. But I should have scored that. Look at that pace from a bond hold. Vince is past my player. My centre back side so don't have no place. pace. Literally, no one's got any pace. You can see that I had five shots on target. He had five as well, but he had eight shots altogether. But he just keeps breaking through my defence, playing these balls over the top. And like I said, I think a bond has got 90 pace, King's got 90 pace, and to do with that, my defenders did really well, to be honest. Well, my keeper did really well, I should say, because my defence, like I said, nothing. They're good at heading and defending, but not good at thingy, uh, running. <laughs> so this guy gets a bit unlucky there, he hits the crossbar, foot, and it just comes off a keeper to go out for a corner, so I was quite happy, but he didn't make nothing of that corner. And here, a little bit of skill, <laughs> thought I'd try it, didn't really work, but here he takes me out as I pass the ball for a penalty, so it's 2-1 at the moment, Mariapa, he's the Jamaican one, I couldn't remember his name. So my right back, Jacobson, has an 84 penalty, which is pretty decent, and slots it down the middle for it to be 3-1 now, in the 61st minute. So, and then, sh oh, I'm not even going to pronounce names, I should... He had a lot of chances in this game. I had a, quite a lot, I suppose. I think my chances were more. I should have scored more, but then he had his chances here. 
But my player here on the f the uh, volley just messes up. But look at look at pace just from my one hole. My players don't stand a chance. And so this guy must have quite a lot of money because I think a one hole goes for like I think like hundred k. I might be wrong here, but I think so. But here a little bit of s skill by Hansen passes to the striker, <laughs> and maybe I should have took a touch first, but I just thought I'd first time it. And keeper going big again. I always seem to get good keepers for some reason. Obviously, it's not a bad thing, it's a good thing, but. We can see our winning 3 2 in the 90th minute now, and look at that, just through once again. But then I sold him, I sold him, brought the keeper out. He thought he tried to chip, chip the keeper, didn't stand a chance. Brought him out, run him back, little tip for you. And I do believe. Look at his header, look at that, it sets it up. Beautiful, should have scored here. Or did I score? No, I didn't. I went for a cheeky chip, and that was it. But that's the first episode. Thanks for what anyone watched, and bye.